have four routers to unbox from Western Digital, and we are going to start with the lowest end one, because that's always the hardest when you have an entire series of products, and sort of talking about the cool features that are present is taking the lowest end one out of the entire product stack and figuring out sort of what's exciting about it. In this case, it's not actually that difficult, because the MyNet series of routers has the, what, really one key feature that goes above and beyond what kind of anyone else is doing. It's called Fast Track. So Fast Track is, as WD describes it, <clears throat> you, uh, Fast Track, stop waiting, start watching, smooth HD streaming to your smart TVs, tablets, smartphones, computers, and other connected devices. So it is quality of service that rather than setting up manually within like a QoS menu inside the web interface for your router and logging into that and then um, you know, manually putting things into it, which is kind of a chore. Every time you have some new game and you have to build some new profile just to make sure that it's prioritized, it's sort of stupid. Um, so Fast Track, the idea is you turn it on and based on profiles that WD builds for the MyNet N600 as well as the N750, it will just kind of automatically prioritize the things that need extra bandwidth and it will reserve bandwidth for them so that they don't lag and they don't stutter. With the MyNet 900, it actually recognizes the shape of the traffic and dynamically adjusts so it'll go, oh, that looks like a game, and it'll dynamically reserve bandwidth for it even without WD rolling out profiles in their firmwares. But with the lower end ones, you do have to rely on the profiles from Western Digital. This particular router is a dual band 300 plus 300 megabit per second router, so effective and 600 speed. Good range. <laughs> really? They put that on there. Good range. Uh, easy setup, fast track streaming, full HD 1080p. Okay, it better be if it's... Uh... Oh, look at this. They have a convenient product comparison here too. So range is house and then there's a bigger house and there's a really big house. Okay. Fast track, fast track, fast track plus is the adaptive one. Very cool. 1000 Ethernet ports, so it does have fast wireless but only fast Ethernet. Fast Ethernet isn't fast anymore, it's Gigabit Ethernet is the faster one. One USB 2.0 port, so Western Digital is a storage company, so it stands to reason that they would want to, you know, I don't know, configure their routers so that you can add storage to them. So something like a MyBook Live would be a perfect companion for one of their, uh, for one of their MyNet routers. Uh, in fact, if you use a MyBook Live, you can even enable additional features like uh, Apple's file protocol, so you can use Time Capsule. That's what it's called, right? Time Capsule? Time Machine? Time Capsule, I think. Hold on. Yay, Google! Time Capsule is the Apple device that has storage inside of it that allows you to use Time Machine to back up your PCs over the network. So, this will behave kind of like a Time Capsule once you attach a qualified external drive to it. Otherwise, you don't get that Apple protocol and you can still use it as storage but just not with the extra features. So in terms of the physicality of it, you got a power LED, wireless LED, interwebs LED, and W W E P W P A, yeah, wire five protected, yeah, W P A. Uh, WWPS. There's the button for WPS, which is sort of next to the LED indicator, which means that I should have probably realized that at some point in time. There's your power button on the back. Ooh, nice toggle power button. DC in. Four fast Ethernet ports. Remember, fast doesn't mean fast. Fast means not as fast, which is okay because this is a lower end product. Uh, there's your WAN port, there's your USB storage port, and there's your ventilation holes. And other than that, there's not much else to say about it. I mean, it's, you know, simple to set up, I suppose. Let's see if they have a quick start guide. So start here, start in see here. Okay. One, two, three steps for Mac. One, two, three steps for Windows. Hey, ironically, the one, two, three steps for Windows actually look a lot simpler than the one, two, three steps for Mac. Uh, uh, there's a disk. You can use that if you want. Comes with an Ethernet cable, comes with a power adapter, and also comes with da, 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 technical support and a limited warranty guide with a whole bunch of numbers all over the world that some of them don't even make any sense. I mean, how many? Oh, that's three different phone numbers. I was like, is that a phone number? For Singapore? I mean, Singapore. They must have to remember, like, 30 digits just to call somebody. Thank you for checking out my unboxing and first look at the MyNet N600 from Western Digital. Don't forget to subscribe to Linus Tech Tips from unboxings, reviews, and other computer videos. And I did mention it was dual band, but I didn't mention it's 2.4 gigahertz and 5 gigahertz, which is what dual band means, but not everyone knows that. Don't forget to subscribe.